This is a Windows Phone 7 app review of Flux, which is available in the marketplace for $2.49 and has a free trial. So Flux is a Google News Reader and it syncs with your Google account so that you can get all your uh, news subscriptions right on your Windows Phone in a nice mobile friendly format. And it has basically everything you could want here. It has a real nice fluid fast interface and easy to use, syncs up all your articles, you can separate things by the different subscriptions like I'm subscribed to NeoWin and WM Power User so it's all really nice and easy to use interface there has filters like all on red and also starred articles and some of the coolest things is that now it has caching so that it'll actually once you open the app it'll cache the new articles in case you lose your internet connection, you can still open the article without an internet connection. And you have settings in the app to do the caching on Wi-Fi only or cellular and Wi-Fi, so you have full control over that and you can disable it too. And it can cache the images too, so it all creates a really great performance there. And really fast and quick and easy to use, has features like double tap to uh, mark as read or unread. So, really polished, and it's obvious that the developer of the app actually uses this app himself because he's added all these little tiny details that make the app just perfect. And also has a mark all as red button, and you can pin individual feeds to your start screen. Like, you can pin WM Power User there. Oh, it's already pinned. And you can pin NeoWin.net, and both of those are already pinned, apparently. Actually, only one of those are pinned, but... <laughs> so then you can actually have your separate uh, feeds as live tiles, and you can tell what's new there. And it's fully Windows 8 compatible, so instant resuming right there. Really quick, really nice to use. And as you can see, it tells you when it's doing that image caching, and just performs really well. You read things in the mobilized format. You can also always open them in Internet Explorer can star things, you can share things, so has basically everything that you'd want here. There's very few complaints that I could get. One complaint could be that it doesn't have a multi-select list, so you can't select multiple things and mark them as red. It's either just double tap or everything as red. So one very minor complaint there. And another little nitpicking detail is I think the live tile could have a little more information at first because either it displays an image of the newest um, article and the image is typically low resolution and that's not something the developer can do anything about but it just looks poor so I disabled that and otherwise all the tile does on the front is just display this icon and it has the little black circle saying how many new articles there are it doesn't even have the proper uh, Windows Phone style counter like email does or texting does so that could be improved, and I think it'd be nice if it actually showed you some information on the front of the tile instead of having to wait for it to flip over to the back, where it then just tells you the newest headline. But overall, Flux is a really great Google Reader app and has basically every feature you could want. And it's available in the marketplace for $2.49, or it has a free trial, and the free trial lets you experience pretty much everything. So it's definitely worth downloading. It's a really great app, real polished nothing you can really complain about. So check it out in the marketplace, it's called Flux.